Hey, if you own a business and you're interested in the stock market, wait. You may be sitting on an even bigger investment opportunity and it can pay you back $26 for every $1 you invest. Here's the story. It's the story of how I turned $10,000 into $300,000 in pipeline revenue in 60 days for one of my clients. Background. When Mike Snuffer found me, his sales were stagnant. His business makes a B2B software as a service. And like many, his sales were hit hard after COVID. Cold calling and cold email were not working. We had virtually nothing in our sales pipeline. We were really in a bind, he said. Process, I created a new marketing campaign using my voice of the buyer copywriting method. It's based on a simple idea. You don't have to write great sales messages if you can hear them. You see, no matter how good your business is, you are not your buyers. Your thoughts are not their thoughts. Your words are not their words. Your buyers speak the language of other buyers better than you do, which can make them better at selling your business than you are. In this case, I reviewed dozens of client testimonials about Mike's software, then created a campaign in the voice of his buyers. Two sales letters, two emails, and a warm call phone script. Simple and easy to execute. We mailed the letters, sent emails, and made follow-up phone calls that actually got through to decision makers, he said. When we spoke to people, they were largely pre-sold and ready to talk. So what happened next? The results, within days, Mike's team had their first appointment. Their sales rep had conversations with 12 of 24 targeted accounts, a response rate of 50%. They, they put over $300,000 of revenue into their sales pipeline, more than triple what they had before in 60 days. The results were incredible, said Mike. The return on investment is phenomenal. We expect to get back at least $26 for every $1 we invested. This is what's possible when you listen to the voice of the buyer. Now, want to see a case study? You'll find a link in the comments below. Be sure to like and subscribe for more marketing tips like these. And thanks for watching.